What's up guys, it's Meaty Mike. My name's Mike and I love meat. Get your smokers fired up because today we are smoking some Hawaiian pineapple pork chops. Let's do it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We have here four bone-in pork loin chops. And I'm dubbing these Hawaiian pineapple pork chops because of the brine that we're using. Then we're also adding pineapples and Hawaiian barbecue sauce later on in the cook. But first, let's start with the brine. So I already brined these chops. I added two cups of pineapple juice, a half a cup of brown sugar, a half a cup of salt, and one tablespoon of coarse black pepper. I mixed that all together. Then I added all four of these chops into that mixture. To finish it, I just topped it off with water to make sure all of the chops were covered. I let them sit in the fridge and brine overnight, pulled them out today, rinsed them off, patted them dry, and now we're going to get on to the next step to get our pork chops into the smoker. And that pineapple brine, you can smell the pineapple on these chops right now. These are going to be nice and juicy. And to stick with that kind of sweet flavor, we have some meat so horny. Pecan Tom's Rib Rub, a good, sweet, smoky pecan rub that's gonna complement the pineapple brine flavor and also that Hawaiian pineapple barbecue sauce that we use later on in the cook. So just get your rub and we'll just coat up our chops. And I don't have any gloves, living life on the edge today. We're just gonna rub in can rub, flip them over, get the other side, rub it on in. And that, my friends, is all we are doing to prep these. Again, we have that sweet pineapple brine that we use to get a lot of that flavor into these chops. Now we have a good sweet and smoky rub. We're gonna let these sit out for about a half hour, 45 minutes, let those flavors infuse, then we'll go pop them right on the smoker. All right, y'all, we're out here at the Po Man Grill. We got it running at 250 degrees. I'm feeling this cook with some Jealous Devil Max, extra large briquettes, and using some chunks of apple wood, a good fruit wood to complement the pineapple flavor we're going for for these chops. For our final internal temp, we're looking to take these chops to 145 degrees, but I got my meter plus. I set it on my app to call me at 130 degrees because that's when we're going to come back out, add our Hawaiian pineapple barbecue sauce and pineapple slices, so stick around. All right, y'all, so the Meter Plus called me at an internal temp. We're at 130 in our chops. It took us about an hour to get to this point. Now we're gonna add some Hawaiian pineapple barbecue sauce from Bash Brothers. We're gonna add our sauce to one side. Flip them over. Add them to the other side. Throw our pineapple slices on there. Add a little bit more sauce. All right, so now we're gonna let our chops finish cooking. I reset the app on the Meter Plus to call me at 140 degrees, because then we're gonna pull them out, tent them in foil, and let them rest until they climb to 145 degrees. Then we'll eat. And with that, our Hawaiian pineapple pork chops are complete. I don't make pork chops a lot, just being honest with you, but these look unbelievable. They have some awesome color on them, some great pineapple. I know they're going to be juicy. I know they're going to be sweet. I know they're going to be delicious. So let's dive right in. Grab our knife here, push these other chops to the side. Oh, goodness. And we're going to cut in to one of our chops, get some pineapple in there. Oh, yes. Mm. Oh, pineapple. That is a freaking pork chop. 
nice and juicy, a good smoke flavor, good tangy, sweet barbecue sauce, that pineapple. That pineapple brine really sticks out. It's crazy, when you bite, even if you took the piece of pineapple away, when you bite into this pork chop, it tastes like a sweet, fruity pineapple flavor and really good mixture with that salt and that coarse black pepper, a little bite to it with that brown sugar. That Bass Brothers Hawaiian pineapple barbecue sauce, their line of barbecue sauces has not disappointed. And that sweet and smoky pecan rub from Meat So Horny, mm, some great, ah, juicy, my mouth is watering. I know the best part too, and I've been waiting to do this. I like the nibble right on the bone. Mm hmm. Huh. If you like to make pork chops, get some pineapple juice, make that nice sweet brine, brine it overnight, get a good sweet and smoky rub. That can rub is perfect. Put it in the smoker with a good fruit wood. We went with apple. You get yourself some Hawaiian pineapple or fruity pineapple barbecue sauce like that and put some fresh pineapple slices on it, man. It's just perfect. You're gonna have yourself some beautiful, beautiful pork chops. Go throw them in the smoker. You're gonna love them. Stay tuned for the next video.